My name is Karina Sia. I am a third year MD-PhD student here at Mount Sinai. I'm in the labs of Dr. Kristen Brennan and Dr. Laura Huckins, and my project studies PTSD and the genetic and environmental factors that interact to contribute to PTSD development. Today, what I'm going to do is take you to meet some of my friends in the program. Hi, Danny. And talk a little bit about my life here at Sinai. I live about 10 blocks away from Sinai, so I'm about to walk to campus, and I'm going to show you some of my favorite places around the way. Since I live so close to campus, within that 10 blocks, there's so much to do so many things to see, all kinds of stuff to explore. One place I'm going to show you is Cafe Siena. Me and my MDPhD cohort sit outside and just really, really enjoy some mimosas and then just hang out all day. The second I walk onto campus, the first people I see are patients. It really makes it hard to separate patients from my everyday thinking. That's kind of what makes some of our researchers so strong and really just makes being a physician scientist so important. I work in Dr. Laura Huckins' lab where we look at the genetics and genomics behind neuropsychiatric disease. We do this by like large scale genomic methods, really big data. Sometimes we're looking at hundreds of thousands of individuals and their entire genome. This is the code where I am running my algorithm to try and predict gene expression from genotypes. I have predicted information for all these different genes, all these different SNPs, and all of my significance values. The next thing that we're gonna do is go up to the floor above me at the HESS Center to the Neuroscience Department where you're going to meet one of my best friends and classmates, Sam Allen. Are we going to show me your lab? Yeah. I inject viruses into the brain to uh, isolate neurons. That's a little brain slice. Oh my gosh, I can see like the whole hippocampus and Isn't stuff. Isn't that crazy? Yeah. The next thing is to show you guys a little bit about OJ's research. Jay, what does the what does your lab do? So you try to figure out the genetics behind these rare diseases that affect your immune system. Okay, the last person I'm going to take you to see now is my friend Ohm. So Ohm works in the Department of Microbiology. What's your project on? So I'm studying mumps virus and its tropism in T cells. We can find out why some of these outbreaks are happening even among vaccinated people. Okay, so now I'm gonna take you to a place that is my favorite place to study because it is quiet and no one knows it exists. Definitely a secret spot for us. So this is the fifth floor lounge. This is where every anatomy exam, I would come right here sit here with like six friends and we would all just study and we would all eventually end up in these rows like taking our exam. Eventually we would like pop up and be like, I'm done! <laughs> Another thing that I really care about and have been very involved in um, during my time at Sinai is working on some anti-racism efforts. So here's the petition that we wrote for the removal of the race correction factor in the EGFR equation at Mount Sinai. This really allowed me to see how activism can make a difference. I hope you enjoyed seeing my day and I really hope you enjoyed getting to meet 
some of my really dear friends in the program. I really feel like we do such amazing work here and I'm so grateful for all the little things about Sinai. Thank you and um, I hope we get to see you soon.